Judge Top has completed his placings in the Melting Shorthorn Aged Cow class. Junior exhibitors, if you could please take a step forward. The second place junior is entry 951, Purple Idly RR Ziva EXPET, shown by Taylor Graves of Danville, Kentucky. The second place junior is entry 952. She's also the production award winner in the class, GMC Fido Haley, shown by Lindsay Clark of GMC Farm, Cornish Fallet, New Hampshire. At four years, one month of age, 305 days, she produced 26,385 pounds of milk, 4.7% 4 fat, 1,235 pounds of fat, 2.9% protein, and 764 pounds of protein. Placing third in the class is entry 960, Nix's Mice, shown by Joseph Nix and Corstar Farm, Litchfield, Minnesota. And in second place, she's also best bred and owned in the class, entry 956, Kuzmar Mercury, shown by Stephen and Susan Kuzlik, Batavia, New York. Winning the class and the title of best utter is entry 3063, Heavenly Betty, EXP, shown by Ryan Ryda, Worthington, Massachusetts. Congratulations. And now to our judge for his reasons. Wow, what a terrific group of aged cows as well. You got two cows that sorted themselves at the top fairly easy for me and Lee. The cow starts a class. She does it with that depth and sweep to the rib. She's also longer and snugger in her forehead attachment. She's cleaner boned all the way through and a real stylish cow coming out in second. You admire the second prize cow. Just like to give her a little more depth and spring and drop to her fore and rear rib today. Also like to make her a little longer and snugger in her forehead attachment. You admire the cow when you get behind her. You admire the high wide rear rudder attachment. At times she does get a little bit shelfy in that rear rudder. But you admire the uphill run that she's got. She goes ahead of the cow in third. You admire this third prize cow. She's a cow that's just 10 years old, seven lactations. Been milking here three months. You admire the youthfulness that she does. Cow walks out on a tremendous set of feet and legs. You admire the straightness of the lines, the depth and sweep of the rib that she has to go ahead of the cow and fourth. There's a little more drop to her rear rib today. A little more height and width at the top of the rear rib today of the real nice balanced cow coming out and fourth. You admire the fourth price cow. You admire the uphill run that she's got, the hardness across the top. You admire the youthful mammary system. Just like to see a little more height and width to the rear rudder today. But she is a little more youthful in her mammary system than the cow coming out in fifth. You admire the fifth place cow for that tremendous frame she has. She's 10 years old, has had eight calves. Just like to make her a little cleaner all the way through, a little more sharpness and dariness, the angularity. I'm going to give her advantage over our sixth place cow with definition of seam. You really like the sixth place cow from the side profile when you get behind her. Just don't have that crease today. Like to have them teeth set up underneath that rear rudder a little nicer as well. But a nice group of aged cows.